have a 71 International Scout. It's a compound turbo, 4BT, 6-speed automatic on 40s, coilovers, bypass, blah, 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 blah. What are we doing? We're here at KOH. It was King of the Hammers in Johnson Valley. This is the hardest single-day off-road race on planet Earth. Now, the truck behind me initially wasn't designed to be a KOH car. If it was, it would be a race car. I, we planned on having building a driver that had exceptional capability off-road. But when we were going to finish the car and the timing of KOH seemed to work out, and we figured if you want to say you have a capable car, why not find out how capable? This is a street legal truck. We basically brought a paper clip to a gun battle. And so we're just going to try and hold our own. For us, a big success is driving this truck across the finish line. We're surrounded by people that live this, that live here, that do this every weekend. Their life has been based in this. For us, this is a big leap. This is something we don't do often. And I'll tell you this, it's been one hell of a learning curve from hot rods to racing Ultra 4. There's definitely some things I do different, but the big thing is, is that we're here and we're going to put what we built to the challenge. When I say we're stretching our legs, I mean it figuratively and literally. Its inauguration into the off-road existence, into the off-road world, is going to be on uh, Backdoor. And we're going to take a brand new, untested truck, and we're going to see what KOH and what Johnson Valley has for it. And if we survive here, we think we can survive anywhere.